You bought an Apple Pencil and no one explained to you what you can do with it? That's exactly what we are going to change today. No matter which pencil you use, in under 6 minutes I will show you all the important tips and tricks for the Apple Pencil. We'll start with tips that work with all generations including the Apple Pencil 1. With all Apple Pencils you can scribble. That is, you can write handwritten notes in any text field and the text will automatically be converted into typed text, ideal for quick notes or messages. This feature is usually activated automatically, you just have to start writing. If it doesn't work, go to Apple Pencil in the settings and make sure that Scribble is activated. The Apple Pencil is perfect for highlighting text or annotating in PDFs. You simply load a PDF into the pre-installed Notes app. Then you can highlight important points in documents and write notes in the margins. This way you can also quickly sign PDFs and fill out forms without buying any PDF app. Your pencil also recognizes what you want to draw. If you draw freehand shapes such as circles, rectangles or lines and hold the pencil briefly, they are automatically converted into clean geometric shapes. This way you can quickly create neat sketches. Another feature of the pencil is that you can use it to quickly create notes. To do this, simply swipe from the bottom right corner of the screen to the center and the note will open immediately. You can also easily take a screenshot using your pencil. To do this, swipe from the bottom left corner to the center and then you can annotate the screenshot directly with the pencil. If you want to delete type text, you can simply cross it out with your pencil to delete words or entire passages. Notes that you have written by hand with the pencil can easily be copied as text by tapping and holding on them with your finger. Did you know that you can create a new note directly from the lock screen? Simply tap the lock screen with the pencil and a note will open without having to unlock the iPad. If the function doesn't work for you, make sure that access notes from lock screen is activated in the notes section of the settings. When drawing, the pencil recognizes how hard you press and draws a thicker or thinner line accordingly. If you tilt the pencil, you can even create a soft shading just like with a real pencil. This is pretty cool and you have to know about it first. Only the Apple Pencil USB-C is not pressure sensitive. Unfortunately, it's not possible to get to the home screen with the Apple Pencil, but you might want to do that when you are working and need to go there quickly. We will show you a trick. To do this, you have to activate the assistive touch function and define an action to take you to the home screen. To do that, go to the iPad settings and select accessibility. Here you have to activate assistive touch and set the function home for an action such as single tap, double tap or long press. After that, whenever you want to go to the home screen, you can interact with the floating assistive touch button with your Apple Pencil. Incidentally, you can use this method to define many other actions for your pen. Now let's move on to features that only work with the second generation Apple Pencil and up. The Apple Pencil 2 offers a double tap feature for quickly switching between two tools. You can quickly switch between tools for example from the pen to the eraser by double tapping the flat area of the pencil. If this doesn't work with your pencil, go to the settings and select what you want the double tap to do in the Apple Pencil category. For example, a tool change or displaying the color palette. Starting with the 4th generation iPad Pro with 11 inches and the 6th generation 12.9 inch device, you can also hold the pencil slightly above the display to see its tools and controls. It's a hover feature. Of course, this also works with the Apple Pencil Pro. On all iPads with the hover feature, you can open the notification center and quick settings by tapping the time, Wi-Fi or battery icon with the stylus. Now we get to a few features that only the latest Apple Pencil Pro supports. A time saving feature of the Apple Pencil Pro is the squeeze gesture. You can squeeze the sides of the pencil to quickly access the tool palette and switch between different tools. If you want to work quickly and effectively, this will be a real game changer for you. By the way, you can use the settings to determine which actions are linked to the squeeze gesture. The Apple Pencil Pro also has a built-in gyroscope that detects when you rotate the pencil. This allows you to control lines and shapes even more precisely, which is particularly handy for technical drawings. If you ever misplace your Apple Pencil Pro, you can easily find it again using the Find My app. Simply locate the pencil via Bluetooth and you will see where it is. 
the creative paper tracing function is really interesting. You can place a sheet of paper on the iPad screen and draw through the paper. The display shines through the paper a bit and you can digitize any sketch. Obviously, Apple didn't necessarily intend for this to work, but it just works great. With iPadOS 18, Apple has added a few more cool features for the Apple Pencil. The update is available now. It's almost a miracle that the iPad now has an official calculator. At first glance, it looks the same as on the iPhone, but if you tap the calculator symbol, you can access the mathematical notes. Here you can do calculations by hand and the app will automatically calculate your equations. This is very useful for students. Another new feature in iPadOS 18 is the ability to automatically improve the readability of handwriting. You can turn this on and off at any time in the settings. When you write something by hand, the written text is then automatically made a little more readable. This makes my handwriting easier for me to read for sure. Those were all the important tips and tricks for the Apple Pencil. If you want to learn more about how to use your iPad, subscribe to this channel for similar videos like this.